In this video, we'll write the balanced net ionic equation for Ag2CO3 plus HCl. This is silver carbonate, and this over here is hydrochloric acid. The first thing we need to do is balance the molecular equation. This is the molecular equation here. I have two silvers and just one here. Let's put a two right here. Now I have two silvers. I have two chloride ions here. Put a two here. That looks like that balances our equation. So the molecular equation is balanced. Now we can write the state for each substance. That looks like this. If you know your solubility rules, carbonates in general are insoluble and silver compounds are most often insoluble. So silver carbonate, that's going to be a solid. So we'll start out with solid silver carbonate. Hydrochloric acid is a strong acid. And then silver chloride, AgCl is insoluble. This is probably one you should memorize. Carbon dioxide is a gas and water is a liquid. Next, we'll split the strong electrolytes into their ions for the complete ionic equation. That looks like this. So this is the complete ionic equation for Ag2CO3 plus HCl. You note we don't split solids apart in net ionic equations, so we kept these together here, and we don't split liquids or gases apart, so these stay together. Now we would cross out spectator ions, except there aren't any. Everything in the reactants and the product is unique, so there's no spectator ions. There's nothing the same on both sides. So this is both the complete and the net ionic equation for silver carbonate plus hydrochloric acid. You'll note that the charge is conserved. We have 2 times 1 plus. That's 2 plus. And then we have 2 times 1 minus 2 minus. So this charge here, the whole charge adds up to 0 on this side. These are neutral, so it's 0 as well. The atoms, they're balanced too. This is Dr. B with the balanced net ionic equation for Ag2CO3 plus HCl. Thanks for watching.